Okay, Sly. We need to send Carmelita a radio pulse so she can home in on the blip. To do that, I'll need you to get on top of four very tall towers. They are too big to climb and too tall to jump up normally. What's this all got to do with this thing you've got me wearing? It's an experimental mega jump pack. By pressing the R2 button, you'll perform a huge jump. So be careful. All right. Sounds like fun. Hey, anyway, look at that. Neat. Oh, gosh. I like this. This would have made it easy in that clue. Woo! Uh, I don't want to go. Oh, yeah, I guess I could have glided, huh? Make it on top of that. Hey, okay, look at this. We didn't even need to be on the higher part of the ramp. Right, we could just jump on it right away. Where are we going? I'm having fun here. Just to jump me. Alright, we're going this way. Bonk. Is that why these assist? Can we jump off of, uh... Yeah, we can. And that is why, probably why these assist then. The way they are. Oh, no, we are just supposed to go to that spot, okay. Is this a mine? I don't like that. Now it just looks like an armed mine. And, like, I played Finding Nemo, it's carried my channel to the amount of subscribers that I have right now. For the most part. Uh, speaking out of experience, pretty dangerous to be stepping on top of those. But then again, as long as we don't do it two more times, we should be fine. Like, on the same mind, I mean. differ on that one. I was kind of spamming circle there. You know there's a guy that would buy that. Okay. Well, at least we saw this somewhat higher jump to mess around with. Yeah, I'm okay with that. Let's keep this one. Ugh. I want to see what the name was. I'm gonna leave this gunner. Not flirty chit chat. Yeah, did she need to use the, the, the speaker on the thing though? I thought that was a giant missile on uh, a 
thought it was one of the hitters, but that was just one of the engines, I'm pretty sure. I... The bird, not the air. Keep at it. We're winning. I why can I not hit these? Don't know. Looking good. What are, what are you doing with your eyes there? Clock clock. I'd stop in that. We're getting through. I don't appreciate. Oh, those take multiple hits. Oh no. Man, why couldn't we have one of these for, uh, like, when we fought the original clockwork? It's pretty handy dandy. I do say so myself. A lot better than having that, uh, that jetpack and whatnot. That sucks. Yes. Yes, it did. We'll be back.
apparently I was doing great, but now I'm not. Terrific shooting. Oh yeah, I was gonna ask where the helicopter came from. Where did she get that? Fly. We've got a serious problem here. Makalo's looking mighty upset, and I think she's going to take it out on us. Oh, there they go. I picked up the whole room. Oh. I'm coming, guys. Hold on. Why can't we just be floating over there? I really don't. Murray doesn't like being trapped. Free, free Murray. Well, that was a deadly fan. Apparently, deadlier than it was before. to do about that one. I just feel cheated on that one. What's this bird gonna stop? Just make it stop! I can't take it anymore! All over the place. It's 
So, what was that like vortex of like tornado we smoke? That was just happening. Like it just went horizontal and flew by. I did not see what it was, but it was hilarious looking. Am I going forward? I oh, am, yeah, okay. Apparently a lot more than I thought it was. You're still the low-down, backstabbing coward we've beaten time and time again. This won't be any different. Be brave while you can. I might not have been without you for a minute, but I feel some, some power growing within me. Oh gosh, I'm just trying to run forward there. And it was already like taking me off the wing. Shoot me here, I'm just standing here. Uh, are we done? You look. Yeah, okay, I just wanted to be hit on this side. Pretty classic. Bit of your health, okay. First for me. Emotional moment. Die, insects! Die! My hate will smash you. Watch out! That thing's still kicking. Lakla mentioned something about a hate chip. It sounded like the source of her power. If we remove it, she might stop attacking. Then let's do a little open head surgery. I'll pry open that beak so that family can go to town with his bombs! Still wearing them, despite screaming specifically about them. And there we were, at the end of the road. The claw gang had been defeated, and the clockwork parts lay scattered around in heaps. Yet, despite the explosion, they remained pristine. It was as if nothing could ever hurt them. Carmelita cursed herself for showing up too late to get a few shots in on Clockla. So she took it out on what was close at hand. The hate chip. And just like that, it was over. Without that core piece, that essential center of clockwork, there was nothing left. 
The parts aged before our eyes as if time had finally caught up with the ancient bird. How ironic that Carmelita, a police officer, would be the one to lift the curse from the Cooper family. The menace of clockwork would never again rise to threaten me or my children. True to her nature, she informed us that we were all under arrest. But one look at my gang told me that we were in no shape for a fast getaway. So I offered to go peacefully in exchange for letting my friends walk. They'd taken some bruises through all of this, but I was surprised, shocked really, to see them leave their gear behind as they walked away. Their wounds were deeper than I'd imagined. Those guys were hurting. Carmelita's old police unit soon arrived. With me in custody, her name was cleared, and she even got a well-deserved promotion. It was the least I could do. The ride to HQ started with us sitting in silence, trying to read each other's thoughts. As the reality of my capture started to sink in, she began to relax, and we got to talking. We spoke freely about our previous adventures, comparing notes and even getting in a few laughs. Then we started talking about, well, everything. Books, music, art. It was like we were on a first date. She even showed me the bottle she'd been saving for the special occasion of my arrest. My heart sank when she realized that our short flight across town had already taken two hours, a fact I kind of clued into after seeing the Eiffel Tower float by 17 times. She went forward to ask the pilot what was up, and it looked like my pals had left me a little going away present before taking off. Floating away on the night breeze, I could faintly make out Carmelita's voice. I'll find you, Cooper! I'll be seeing you soon, Ringtail. How'd they... How'd they do that? The helicopter. I don't know who. But somehow they did. By the way, I guess that's it for this game. Uh, thankfully it only took me a few tries to fight Clockwa. Instead of, like, Clockwork in the first game, it took me, like, 50,000 years to fight. Progress! Now we'll never have to do it again. We broke the hate chip and all the parts age. Okay, we're getting some more visuals. Need him. At least he did return that. You could have just drank it all. I guess I probably could have read that. Dimitri went on to work as a dance instructor on the cruise ship. John now owns a series of road outlets across North America. The Contessa went on to become the most successful real estate broker in the greater... I didn't get to read the rest of that one. John Besson went on to work for the... Eba? And ended up frozen yet again on a rescue mission saving the penguins. I don't for the best, honestly. Definitely about Harpeggio since he was just eating. No, I will not go outside. Can't tell me what to do. I should go outside. We need to go out on our walk. I haven't done that in a while. But, you know, no. Hey, I actually have 100%. I wonder when they missed another file then. Not sure. I guess I could probably check. Gonna load the save and find out. Oh, what? What? Why was there a square button? 
What, what was that about? Like actually though, wait, why was why was there one? Like with the little bag. Oh. Okay. And just to, to make sure that it really is just the, the one thing, I don't know why this is what made it show up. So it really is the one thing? Oh no. Oh no, oh no, I can't. Okay, well, it's different. Uh, problem. I can't skip the credits. <laughs> okay, whatever. Oh, there's more. There wasn't one on episode two, but there's one on episode three. The one on episode three just does that. Okay. So much for there being more, I guess. All right then, hey, for episode four. Nope. Wonder why this is a thing. Was this intentional? Or is this just a thing that I accidentally just did? Because considering one of them just brought us back to the main menu, I'm starting to think that it's not intentional. <laughs> and that one of them brought us back to the credits. If you go to a bunch of movie, all it is is the setup, the getaway, the setup, the getaway, the setup, the getaway. Also brings us back to the thing. Okay. Sure. Oh, in that case, I'll do one last save. Uh, and then I'll load that other file, and we'll see which thing, random thing I missed. Probably a clue, and I want to say it's Dimitri's place, honestly.
but we'll find out. Nope, I missed stuff in that one, okay. And everything else should be 100%. Oh, no, I actually missed models in a lot of the places, actually. Okay, apparently the saves only count for 1% for missing three of them. Wow. Also, see, I told you that he had to cry for money. Real quick, I'm just gonna show where that one actually never the base was. Yeah, 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 I remember, I remember, I remember the base. No, I mean, look at that, he has like an actual vault in that thing. In that crossbow. Oh, it's automatically on Murray, apparently. I hit right on it. I still love the speed that you get from using this bounce. It's amazing. Anyway, also you can just jump up here. Which is also why I say it. They don't wouldn't want to give you this earlier, because you can just cheese stuff like that, but yeah, this is where the base was. I could probably make that jump if I did myself. Do you mind? I'm trying to find out if I can make a really good jump. If I really good jump, I mean, just a jump that would kind of cheese. Can I not stand on this rail? There we go. Yeah, you can just make that. Who cares about platforming when you can just go? Oh, whoosh. And yeah, no, I guess I'll do it for this series then. Uh, see you all in whatever game I choose to play next. I haven't quite decided yet. I was thinking, like, Sonic Spinball, but then I remembered that Sonic the Hedgehog came right before this, so... Probably shouldn't. Oh yeah, there's these weird papers that spawn. I don't get where those are coming from. They spawn in the streets. Like the lanterns of Matt. That while uh, riding around, trying to look for that last treasure because I knew I only got the two. And I assume that the one that Demetrius was counting was uh, one of the three. Only makes sense to me. See you all some better time.